Hello everybody, I am Purple Thickman, and today we're going to be playing Kraken Academy. Alright, this game has quick time events. Would you like to set them to easy? Normal's fine. We're just going to jump right into it. Mom, stop complaining. I'm sure you'll like it once you settle in. I just don't understand why Nadia was allowed to join the nice club. You can clearly see who the favorite child is. That is not true. You know I love you both equally. Nadia, you always get what you deserve in life, little brother. Starting off with a nice sibling rivalry. Oh, wow. I love the pixel art in this game. Have fun, sweeties. Thanks, Mom. I miss you so much. Call me from the payphone when you get the chance. Okay, honey? Bye. <laughs> Bye, mother. Ugh, I wish you were sent to a different school. You're not the only one, you know. It would still be very unlikely for me to run into you. I only hang around the, the drama club. A place deserved for the rich and beautiful? Not something a pleb like you would ever see. Nadia sucks. There's just a broken car in the parking lot? Yeah, this place is super trashy. I wouldn't be surprised if she doesn't have any friends. This is Kraken Academy, huh? It looked nicer in the brochures. Why is everything broken and gross? I shouldn't be so judgmental. Maybe it won't be too bad. <laughs> the hobo guy? Oh my god, he has a flamethrower and a pineapple. What is going on? That guy stole my phone. Fighting isn't allowed on the school grounds, delinquent punks. Miss Kostova? Oh god, the car's on fire now. And there's the broccoli girl. All right. <laughs> Your uniform. You're in the music club, too. We need to hurry. Class starts, like, now. Follow me. All, all right. I have so many questions already, right? <laughs> Did you see that sign in the corner that just says, don't go here, and it's pointing to a giant hole? Wait, what? Yeah, <laughs> don't go here. All right. Well, we can run, which is nice. Jeez, you're slow. I'll send you a friend request and crack it in case you get lost. Okay, let's go. Yeah, this game is... Nothing likes a band practice to get over an ex. All right, added to Kraken that Broccoli Girl likes playing the drums, dislikes thinking about her ex. Okay. Oh, wow, we get a whole profile on her. Sagittarius plays the drum. The bio, the sad moment when you see them and they act like you don't exist. Oh, God. It's like a... Almost like a... Facebook or a MySpace profile. Jesus. Well, let's, I guess, go to class. I'm not really sure what, el what else to do. This guy, Ninja. Is this guy going to sell me? <laughs> you want to get in? It'll be 10,000 schlatinky. But that's all my savings for my last 10 birthdays. Well, kid, do you want to go to school or not? Let's, let's argue. No way I'm paying that much. I don't even go to this school. Suit yourself. He's just going to live in the wilderness then? I'm sure Hobo Guy has some space in his cave. Oh, we're going to be sassy. The cave is probably cleaner than this school. But fine. If there's no other choice, I guess I'll pay. Oh, I guess we just pay. Pleasure doing business. Literally all of our money. <laughs> you can't put a price on education. At what age will someone not know what MySpace is? Oh, man, I don't know. If you need me later, you can find me by the South Market. See ya. I'm sure there's a lot of people that are probably like 18 or 19 that have no idea what MySpace is. Or was. What a ripoff. Likes tattoos, dislikes competition. He added me to Kraken it after he basically robbed me. This is the Kraken, Kraken Academy security system. Please present your music club card to gain access. Um, here we go. Thank you, access granted. We've saved a scan of your face in our database. The gate will automatically recognize you from now on. Wait, I didn't agree to this. Uh, all right, well. 
I'm still so confused by what's going on. But I guess we're in the school? The school still looks really bad. I mean, like, the art is good. The school looks like it's in bad shape, though. Oi, oh, this way. We're here to learn music, right? <laughs> what? What is with this school? Over here. We're almost there. All right, let's go meet the class. Huff, huff. Oh man, the teacher's late anyway. We didn't have to run at all. Um, I've never seen you before. What's your name? It's a new school, so that means I can be whoever I want. What's the best name I can think of? Oh, uh, cool. We, I guess we get to put our own name in. You know the name, though. Dick. Oh! Uh, yeah, I guess we just confirm. We're Thickman. Oh, God. Thickman? That's a bit old-fashioned, isn't it? Anyway, I play the drums in the music club. What instrument do you play? Uh, let's be modest. Um, I used to play the keyboard when I was little. Not sure if I can still play. That's alright, you'll get the hang of it. I'm sure. We still need someone for our band. Costodin, the guy with the glasses over there, plays the bass. Try, try not to sound too interested when you talk to him or he won't stop ranting. A lot of me other blonde guys are singer. All the girls are obsessed with him. I'm not, of course. Although he is quite good looking. Simona, the girl in the giraffe hoodie, plays guitar. She's my super bestest friend. She, does, she doesn't always mean what she says. She can be a bit... Yo, BG. Did you bring your game station? Let's play some Witch Princess Battle before the teacher comes. Uh, who's that weirdo? Is he the new kid? Don't tell me he'll be replacing the old Kraken's underling. Where's the old one? <laughs> replacing? What happened to the old one? Nobody knows where she went. She only survived a single day. Jesus. Shh, don't scare him, Simona. Those are just stupid rumors. So, uh, about the game station. I brought above my batteries below. Thickman, do you think you can find some in here? While you do that, you should go and say hi to everyone. I guess we gotta go get batteries? Hey, new kid, do you want to join my fan club? No. No thanks. Wow, really? Just haven't had enough time to appreciate the perfect bone structure of my face. Come back when you change your mind. You fuck this guy. Is he hitting on me? Being this hot would be so hard. Oh, God. Oh, this guy. Alright, new kid. Would you consider yourself to be woke? Yes? Yeah. Nice, finally someone who thinks for themselves. What do you think about the big soda companies then? I can't believe they're hacking our phones. Oh god. They can read every single text. Why soda companies? Think about it. That's why it's so clever. No one would suspect them. Oh god, he's a conspiracy theorist. Ugh. If I were you, I'd check out my newest post on krakennet.com. What is he talking about? Does that site even exist? Dislike sheeple likes conspiracy theories. Ugh. Don't talk to me, asshole. Shoo. You at? She dislikes us. Great. Alright, uh, let's look for batteries. Uh, awful lot of couples counseling books on these shelves. That is weird for a school where everyone is like a literal child. Remember to do the bookshelf. There's a lot of stuff that shouldn't be in a bookshelf. Ah, oh, like batteries. Here you go, see if these will do. Well, thanks, Thickman. Can't believe there were actually some lying around here. I can't either. Oh god, everyone sit down. I'm Mrs. Petrovin. In this class, there will be no slacking. Trust me, I know a slacker when I see one. And all of you look like a bunch of slackers to me. Intense. You see, I used to be an opera singer on the big stage. And I'm stuck here with a bunch of lost cases like you. I used to have a student just as lazy as you. There's nothing we could do, so we sent her to the woods. Oh god, she hasn't been back since. People say she's joined a pack of bears. Don't let that happen to you. Alright, kids. Why don't we write a test to see who ha who we have to cast out? Oh god. It would be especially interesting to see how the new faces over here does. Is he going to be a slacker? Uh, 
It's my first day and they're already starting to abandon me in the woods. I bet my sister didn't have to go through any of this. First question. And what keeps Beethoven's piano sonata 13? Uh, playing a quick time event will help sway the outcome of a conversation. Okay. Make sure to score enough points to fill up the meter below. The circles above lets you know how many times you will play. Press X when the target is over the center of the bar. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah, that was bad. I have no idea. It's E flat my major. <laughs> Can't believe you don't know it. Slacker. Next question. What was Mozart's favorite duck called? I'm sorry, what? Ooh. Good one there. Ducky? That is correct. Last question. Where's my husband's last words before he left me? Oh my god. Ooh, perfect. Look at that. I don't know. He didn't say anything. Correct. He just dabbed and left. Oh my god. What is going on in this game? Very good. Here's your reward. A hundred bottles. Don't spin them all at once. Huh? Miss Markova. Petrova. I repeatedly told you not to come back. Get out of here. She just hisses. Is she? Oh my god. She just runs away on all fours. I guess she's not our teacher? It's a bit uh, unusual. She was fired 20 years ago, but keeps coming back to work. Weird. I'm Miss Markova. And I'll be teaching you music theory. My sleeping cycle got super messed up over the weekend. I'm used to sleeping till noon, so I'll just nap and you guys do some exercises on these sheets, will you? Seriously? Don't be so loud, giraffe girl. You haven't heard me being loud yet. You want me to come over there and show you? Simona. Shh. How am I meant to sleep? Simona. Uh, hey, broccoli girl. Yeah? Trevor gave us these bottles? What the hell am I meant to do with them? Oh right, you're new here. Outside the classroom is a bottle machine. You can turn them in and get a couple schlatinky in return. <laughs> it's good for the environment. The school had to do something with all the plastic trash piling up. You mean it's better that now than it was before? Yep, much much better. Everything is so nice and clean now. Uh, yeah. Here, take this baseball bat. Uh, Alright, cool. Smash lockers and bins to look for even more bottles. Okay. I'm glad our character is just as confused as us. Main class started skipping class. Used to have a drama as a class, and the theme was superheroes, and we needed a hero name, power, and phrase, so I made the brick man. He had brick powers, and his catchphrase was, I'm hard as rock. Oh my god. What am I am, am I just supposed to leave and go smash stuff now? Bottle machine 500. Do you want to convert your bottles? Sure. Okay, so it's a one-to-one -one exchange. Bottles for Schlatinky. Thank you for keeping the environment clean. Flip Corp delicious and heavily padded. It saves snacks machine. Save snack much better than the bland Galaxy Buster Bar. Can I smash it? I'm going to smash it. How do I pull up my inventory? Items. Hmm. Okay, it looks like we can't equip it, unfortunately. I guess you just walk up to stuff and smash it. Oh, I guess let's buy a bottle. Or a snack or whatever. Let's buy one. Oh, this is how you save. Okay. It costs one bottle. So it costs money to save, but it only costs one. Not too bad. This line, to be honest, though, the teacher had to say no, of course. I, it's, <laughs> it's funny. It does seem a, a bit inappropriate for a class. I think something like that, like an Inyo window like that, you gotta hide a little bit better. We got bandages. We've made a lot of money. That feral teacher didn't give us that many bottles, did she? There's so much stuff to smash. Oh my god. This doesn't work. Cool. Can we smash the toilets? We cannot. Who is this? I wonder if the other club's bathrooms look this bad. 
So I guess maybe the music school, the music club is like the outcast club. That kind of makes sense. Band practice on Tuesdays. This is locked. Uh, this is the other bathroom. I'm not super sure what we need all of this money for. 200 pages, I scattered them for you. Pick one up. Although Mozart's legacy in music is legendary, it's common knowledge that his love of music was only rivaled by his intense love of ducks. I can see why this textbook was torn up. What are what are brick powers though? Do you just like throw bricks? Great, let me show you the dorms. Uh don't we have class still? Oh come on, she won't notice we're gone. Our teacher's literally asleep. We like barely have any class, even if you wanted to go back. Those are bottles? Yeah, the stuff that's dropping are bottles. Get the bottles, convert them into money, buy stuff. Something something good for the environment. Thick men, the dorms are over here. Alright. Are these the dorms? God. <laughs> Everyone has their own room. This one's yours. It's a bit empty. We should change that. Here's a little welcome gift. Broccoli girl's bed added to your inventory. Don't you need this one? It's okay. I don't use beds anymore. I prefer to sleep in the soil now. All right. Go ahead and put it in your room. So she is like literally broccoli. How do I equip this? Oh, it says X to decorate, okay. All right, I don't think we have literally anything else. Wow, we can make it not so sad. <laughs> Perfect, now it looks only mildly depressing, <laughs> yeah. Baba Tadorka. Todorka at the market sells tons of stuff for your room. You should check it out one day. In two days, there's this super cool costume party in the abandoned dorms. Of course, there's abandoned dorms. Uh, my ex is coming too, which will be a problem, but I'll try not to cry too much. Oh, God. The whole music club is coming and we'll play on stage. Oh, that's cool. You should totally... I literally don't know how to play music, but yeah, hell yeah. That sounds awesome. Oh, but I don't have a costume. Hmm. You could try looking by the lake. People dump their stuff there all the time. Maybe there's something you could, or something lying around you could use. It's the southwest exit from the main area. Okay. Uh, you should check your map if you get lost. I guess let's go find a costume. God, this game is just a lot. There's a lot going on. There's a lot of existential dread. Everything's falling apart. Uh. I don't... I don't even want to know. What is going on up here? That's Simona. No self-respect at all. Who are these people? Oh, God. Art students. Oh, they're fangirling over the... Oh, God. Over the, the singer. South... I, what, did I go through the right exit? Where's the map? Is that southwest? Okay, yeah. So now we just have to go west. There's a lot of people in this world. It was definitely like really empty in the beginning, but it looks like there's actually a ton of people. Even though this place is just so bad. Uh, can we go this way? Speaker turns on as you approach the gate. Hello, this is the Crackling Academy security system. Access denied. Oh, uh, we need our club access. Okay. Everything is so chaotic. I'm surprised the school is still open. Oh man, what are we gonna have to do to one of these art club people? Sports student? Yeah, I don't really care about you. I wonder what he's like. Is he strict? What's he like? Is he strict? Oh, definitely. When Yuki brought her katana, he could confiscate it immediately. I mean, sure, it was an authentic sharp sword. It was just for her cosplay. I guess we gotta go talk to those art students again. Bricks disappear and when it rains, it's just bricks. So it's quite an awful character. The rain has to hit you though. When you cry, bricks come out instead of tears. So instead of, like, typical things that would be water, like sweat or tears, it's just bricks. That is a... <laughs> That's a character. You want an autograph? Get in line. Oh, God. Vladimir, pay attention to me. 
How can you possibly be? Oh God, You're beautiful and perfect. You must be half God. Jesus, can I like rob one of these girls? Okay, so this is just like repeating dialogue. What is in here? Hey. So what's this pile doing here? Okay. So our people have green uniforms. So let's see if we can, I guess, find another art student that I can. Who keeps trashing all the games? Likes unharmed leaf piles. Dislikes Mepsi. Uh, you look like an art student, right? I heard it in the drama club. Every student gets their own chair. Seriously. I've been sitting on the ground for two years. Jesus. So it looks like some people, like some of the clubs get good stuff. I will say it is really satisfying smashing stuff. This is where I came in. Oh, okay, so this is the market. <laughs> Welcome, my dear. I like to find something that brings you joy. Pineapple plant, midnight riot poster, and a go <laughs> geometric carpet. Okay. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff. Gothic bed, rainbow. I can't afford literally any of that. Dislike stairs. Oh, it's this guy again. Yeah. Art club. Free spirits to... Wait, what? Free spirits to unlock. What does that even mean? Move to free spirits? So this is where we get the different, like, progression items. The cards are a good investment. What, do, what does he mean, free spirits? <laughs> Cafeteria and teacher's office. Okay, let's, let's just kind of explore until we find what we need. Whoa. Whenever I can't afford the cafeteria food, I'm eating safe snacks. Aww. This is another music student. Okay. List with student names on it. This Alex, Alex person, she goes to the nurse a lot. Huh? Okay. And they have to come out of you when it's sweat and tears, so you can easily be in the hospital. Yeah, that, <laughs> that's definitely a character that you chose to create. This is locked in a weirdly wet door. Uh, who are you? Oh, God. This is Petrova. These kids have no respect for us teachers. What is the teacher's office? Oh, well, I have a plunger now, and it is equipped. Smash up the teacher's lounge. Uh, can we? I don't think they want this. Playing DDR, just likes working. I want to talk to. Okay, this is how we talk. We only serve the finest food. Is it healthy? But of course, cafeteria lord. Every Monday and Tuesday we serve dinner here. Only two days a week. What happens on those other two days? That's when I have to work at the nurse's office. Oh, God. Are you qualified for that? But of course. Curing dysentery is no different than brewing first class tea. Dislikes planning meal schedules. Sick, dude. I didn't mean to rerun this dialogue. Ooh, mugs. Most things for making tea. These mugs meant to be clean. It's so horrible there should be an anime. That'd be a pretty pretty good anime. Alright. Let's go in the hole that says don't go here. Oh, it's the hobo guy. Did you make this mess? Oh, wow. He sells us things. Okay, bottle machine upgrades. Oh, so they give us more schlatinky when we give them bottles. Gain friendship heads. What are these different... <laughs> What are these different, like, currencies that we need? We have to free spirits, we need friendship badges. I don't know how they get any of this stuff. Where's... I, I, maybe let's talk to Broccoli Girl? She's, 
she seems to kind of know what's going on here. guys researching got her blog post what does the teacher want go Life is suffering. dislikes mainstream culture love that for her hey. all right the dorms were i believe to the west Alright, Broccoli Girl. Oh, she's just telling me where I need to go. Southwest exit from the main square. I do wish there was a little bit more guidance on how to get, like, the... The currency that they want, I guess. I guess let's look at the bridge. Water smells as bad as it looks. Maybe this isn't the right way. I think I'm trying to go the wrong way. Ah, here we go. I was going the wrong way. That's on me. Thickman, come hither. I'm calling you to fulfill your destiny. Hmm. Sorry, where do I have to go? Keep going. Honestly, though, there's no way you'll miss me. I think we know who this is going to be. There it is. Oh, God. Hello, Thickman. I need a costume? Hi, do you have a costume for me? What? No! Listen, I have to tell you about a really important mission. Broccoli Girl said there could be one lying around here. Broccoli? Kid, I don't care about any costumes. The school's in grave dangers. In three days, everything will be... Okay, well, I guess I'm done here then. <laughs> just leaves. No, come back here. This game is just... It's just satire, and I love it. The cracking coughs. Okay, okay. Let's do this. A mission! You're going on one. Take the... Hmm, where is it? I swear it was right here just a second ago. Thickman, could you uh look around for something that looks like an ancient amulet of unfathomable power? I'll take a look. Likes interior design, dislikes trash at the lake. Uh, I guess let's just smash some stuff up. Try to pry the box open with your noodly arms. Okay. Ooh, nice. Feel it bend a little bit. You kick the box. A perfect and a great. The box begins to crack. Almost there. Summon all your strength for one last push. Press X quickly in order to fill the bar in time. Wow, that is actually a pretty tight timing. Rah! Come on. The box opens enough for you to stick your hand in. All that effort. Uh, well, we got a corrupt jewel. Oh, no, it's broken. Who did this? Damn those kids. Criminals, every single one of them. Thickman, can you find the other pieces? I guess they're just all around here. Smash it up. This It's just a barrel. What do you mean it doesn't work? Reach into the muddy water and pull something out. Ugh, what is this? Ooh, a left tentacle. Okay. And you find a newspaper article. Frequent earthquake earthquakes continue. Scientists have found the epicenter. A recent term to be the local high school cracking the academy. I can only imagine why. Uh, you dig around in the sand. This could be something important. Another tentacle. Did you find all the pieces? Come. Oh, I guess it's like a tentacle amulet. Gross. Smash all this up. I guess that's everything. Have you found anything? Remember that you can give me items by selecting them in your inventory and then talking to someone. Not the psych. Okay. Uh, equip. 
Here you go. Oh, I'm the only one doing work here. Cracking coughs. Let's get back to your mission. Am I your minion? Someone told me you'll make me your underling? Well, I prefer to call it disciple. And now I'd appreciate it if you stopped interrupting me. About your mission. The traitor is among us. They're a powerful entity and could be anyone at this school. Their goal is the destruction of Kraken Academy. You need to prevent this from happening, Thickman. This corrupted relic contains a fraction of my powers, and it will allow you to time travel. I really doubt you'll be able to pull this off on your first attempt. With this, you'll have infinite tries. In three days, nothing will be how it was before. Okay, so I guess this game is like a three-day time loop. Let me show you a vision of what awaits our fate. The spirits that used to protect the school have been trapped. Villain, the stag spirit of the music club. Brusa, the frog spirit of the art club. Toto, the horse spirit of the sports club. Samo, the hawk spirit of the drama club. Without them, in three days, the whole school will go down. Did that just become a blood fountain? Why is everyone on fire? You must free all the spirits. Okay, this is what the free spirits means. I get it. Damn, you need three free spirits. That's a lot. Why don't you just confront the traitor yourself? I'm not powerful enough. You will need all four spirits to defeat them. Yeah, wow. You need three out of four to unlock the different buildings. Uh, the spirits seem to be trapped in students who are in turmoil. Oh, God. First, we will free Villain. I have detected him instead of Broccoli Girl. Oh, God, we're going to have to solve her problems with her ex. Should be able to release the spirit with the amulet. However, we will need to fix her imbalance. Yep, first before the spirit can be freed. She mentioned she wanted to go to this costume party on Wednesday. Oh, perfect. That will be your opportunity to bring balance to her soul. So I guess, like each loop we're gonna have to fix one person to free the spirit and like reset the loop uh just to make sure i've understood this correctly yes save the school from doom and destruction i have to go to a party correct okay but uh i don't have a costume broccoli girl said there would be one here maybe oh well why didn't you say so literally the first thing we said if i gotta check the items with conf or the box with confiscated items at the headmaster's office surely they won't just give me whatever is in there right jeez of course not <laughs> this is a slow one. The other one didn't make it, so I'll, oh my god, I'll have to go with him. I can hear you. Oh, uh, I mean, no, you wouldn't be allowed and someone might see you during the day. I propose you go into the headmaster's office at night and take it then. It's located in the cafeteria building, which is south. Oh, oh, it was that weird wet door, which is south from the main square. If you mess up, don't forget to use the amulet before certain doom hits us all when the three days are up. While you wait for nightfall, why don't you try to make some friends? You're new here, after all. All right, well, I actually think that this is going to be where we end it. We have a really good idea of like what the gameplay loop is going to end up being. Um, and before we get into too many spoilers of the game, I want to go ahead and stop it here for anybody that wants to uh, pick this game up and play it themselves. It's definitely, it's, it's really quirky, and the dialogue is super satirical. And from what I've seen so far, it definitely plays around, like, the typical tropes you would see in like really in like a slice of life school style like anime uh which i think is really cool but let's go ahead and i guess i should go save at the uh soda machine first so that i don't have to redo all this when i come back to play myself as a teacher i bet oh well cutscene. oh a thick man have you found a costume mention let's we're gonna mention the headmaster the kraken i think goes without mentioning no but i think i will check the headmaster's office to keep the confiscated items there really how are you gonna get in there a really high security you know not to mention it's really creepy and almost no one's ever been there um i'll figure it out as i go well think man i'm sure you know what you're doing all right see you at the party on wednesday night yes yeah, so it looks like i don't know we have to kill two days really I have some time to t kill until it gets to the headmaster's office. Call my mom and talk to her until it gets dark. Or explore the school a bit more then. Uh, I'm glad that they have the option to kind of just skip ahead, you know, in a cutscene to the next point in time as required. But you can also see there's like a time meter at the top up there. 
but we're going to go ahead and buy a save snack. Sweet. All right, well, that was Kraken Academy. Like I was saying, really satirical, definitely playing up some tropes, but in a way that I really like. Um, so if you're watching this on YouTube uh, and you like the content, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. really helps the channel out. Uh, and I hope you have a good day, night, whatever it is, wherever you are.